perhaps I should get a little consent. Where's your ID? Everything. What's up, suckers? And welcome back to Everything Courtney. Y'all, it has been a minute. I mean, a minute. But we are back in the kitchen with another Courtney's Kitchen. Ready to get a good meal in. Yes. I got my nails on, y'all. <laughs> These are my real nails. I'm trying to let them grow out. Anyways, so for my first meal back, I am going to make something that I really enjoy eating. Normally my dad makes it for me. This is my first time trying it out. We're gonna see how it comes out because I don't know. So today I am going to be making drunk chicken. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you a little drunk. Mm. The chicken's gonna be drunk. Okay, not me. Or am I already? <laughs> so I have a whole chicken here that I got from the store and I am going to get this thing lit. Okay, we're gonna make some lit chicken. I like that better, lit chicken. To get this chicken lit, we're gonna give it some Miller's High Life, the champagne of beers. I got this chicken stand from Amazon that I'm gonna put the beer in. Oh my gosh, I thought it didn't fit. I'm like, whoa, <laughs> you're an idiot. <laughs> so yeah, put the chicken on top and then put it in the oven and let it do what it do. But first I'm gonna season this bad boy. So, I don't have any gloves. Yeah, I know I don't like touching chicken, but I do have bags and tape. <laughs> oh. oh my God. <laughs> Disgusting, filthy little animal. I asked my dad earlier how to do this, and well, he said it was simple, and uh, we're gonna see. <laughs> Let's just start with bagging of the hands. Tell me where it is, tell me where it is. I'm gonna suffocate you, what's up? Oh, maybe I don't need the tape. I can just twist it. Oh, huh. Stupid. This could be a pro, okay. Oh yeah, you're not gonna tell me where the stuff is? You're not gonna tell me where the goods are? Okay, there we go, right? Um, yep, so here is my bird. This is just, I tried to drown the blood out. This is disgusting. Do my little chicken dance, do my chicken dance. Oh, my chicken to twerk. Put your hands on your back and twerk with it. Go on, lose with it, go on, lose with it. She got her hands up on her knees. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm about to do to you. Is this the booty hole? Perhaps I should have learned a little anatomy of the chicken before I... Oh, this is, this is it. This is the hole I'm looking for. Yep, I'm gonna just take this off. I'm gonna season with my strong hand, this one. I'm gonna start with a little Lowry's. Now, my thing is, I don't know how much a full chicken needs in terms of seasoning, but I refuse to have a tasteless chicken, okay? I refuse to have a seasonless chicken. My Miss Dad seasons don't have salt in it, so. It's okay that I put this much lorries on it. So there, there's that. Keep your hands inside at all times. Thank you. A little onion powder. Nice. All right, now for the dash. Onion and herb. No salt in this, so you go a little crazy, go stupid. My dad told me I could season it with whatever it is I wanted to season it with, so that's what I'm gonna do. A little table blend. It's a generic dash, but you know what? It generically do what it needs to do. Don't wanna come out. I'm so sorry, Mr. Bird. You know, I probably should have said a little farewell first. It's a little too late. Excuse me. Okay. Okay. Ooh, a little chicken. Taste the leather. Yeah. This chicken gonna be so good. <laughs> Cause see all this saltless stuff make it look all nice and pretty, but you know, it ain't much flavor to it, so. And then I am gonna use a little bit of Everglades seasoning. Now this does have salt. It's an all purpose seasoning, but it's so good. This is a dash. You know, a dash is subjective, depending on who's asking. And I think this bird is good to go. Now my dad did tell me that my gloves. He told me I needed to season the inside. So, not that, not that hole. Wrong hole. Ha! Forgive me, Jesus. What's going on? You know what, that's your business, sis. I'm sorry. I, okay, um, 
Look, how much know enough? A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A little bit of this, a little bit of... None of that. A little basil leaf for a little flavor. I feel like I'm wiping off the seasoning. Please, Lord, don't let this be salty, y'all. Now, I've never made a whole chicken before, if you can't tell. I'm gonna add a little bit of garlic to the inside. Just to get that thing full of some flavor. Mm -hmm. Now, here's the fun part. Now that my chicken is all colorful, I'm gonna put the bad boy on top of the can. Perhaps I should get a little consent. Where's your ID? <laughs> Woo! Um, would you like to participate in some spirits? Can you raise your hand? It said yes. I, I gotta. <laughs> All right, my daddy told me that I'm supposed to pop, pop that off and take it. Whoa, wait, wait a minute now, hold up, wait a minute. Calm down. Oh, well, you know what, is this, a, is this the right beard? Let me, let me see. Yep, it, it is. I'm supposed to take this off. Bam. Now I need to put the chicken on top. Oh no! Oh my gosh, look at that bird. Look at that pretty bird. I'm so sorry for what's about to happen. Now we're gonna put the bird in the oven for about 35, 40 minutes and go from there. Goodbye for now. See you, my friends. Okay. Ah! So I'm gonna clean up this area and then we're gonna move on to the sides, all right? All right. And voila, my bird is done. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, you know, I've never done this before. I'm gonna take my bird off of the can. I saw my dad do this. <laughs> Oh, Lord God. <laughs> that looks disgusting. I'm gonna pour some of this beer on top of my bird. Let that juice get stuck up on it now. Put on that. Looks done, right? Let's just go to the sides. So now I'm gonna make some green beans. So I just gave them a nice little rinse off. I'm gonna put them in a bowl. Put a little bit of olive oil on top and some flavor. Onion pata. Difficult table blend. Chicken and a dash of some Everglades for a little bit of salt. The balsamic vinaigrette. They mix it all together, and what do you get? Uh huh, clap, clap, some, some hot dog. Something like that. <laughs> Add a little bit of water. Now for my starch, I'm gonna use some sweet potatoes that I've already. I hear your green beans. I hear you, boy. I hear you. I hear you. <clears throat> I'm gonna use some sweet potatoes that I've already pre boiled, and I'm gonna just make like a sweet potato souffle. A sweet potato mashed potato type thing, you know? Just just make it good. Yep. So I'm gonna peel the skin off because who wants that? Throw that bad boy in there. Just mash it on up. Now I pre-boiled these a few days ago and I forgot I did, so I wanna use them before they go bad. Ooh, I could have made a sweet potato pie, but no. No. Maybe. Maybe. That's already basically done. Have some ground cinnamon. And a little vanilla extract. Did y'all know that you can get I'm not gonna tell y'all chilling that. Forget I said anything. Vanilla extract. <laughs> if you know, you know. <laughs> Smash that around, give it some good flavor. Mm, mm, mm. A little bit of sugar. Mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna mix it, mix it. You trying to compete? I'm gonna put the bird back in the oven, just give it a little more, you know? And then um, it's gonna be time to eat. See you in a second, suckers. Oh, 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 oh. I can't wait. Dude, let's see how crazy you love this food. I'm gonna see you in a minute, man, 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 man.
Woo! Get into this chicken. The wing, the best part of the chicken. Lord God, Jesus! Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Uh huh. Yeah, this chicken is so good. I realize I got hungry. <laughs> a little seasoned green beans, a little Betty table. Mm hmm. Mm. A little crunchy crunch with the lemon is hitting on top of this. You gotta put a little lemon juice on top of your green beans, y'all, with some tagine. Oh. And now for my sweet potato souffle. Put a little butter on top. Lord, I just want to say thank you, Jesus. Hey, God. Mm. Thank you, Lord, for knowing how to cook, Jesus. Yes, God. Hey. Mm. Y'all, this is good. Like, oh my God, I'm so proud of myself. I had pretty standard expectations, but I think I exceeded this. I think, to, uh, humble, humbly, <laughs> humbly. <laughs> this is busting. I hope y'all try to make some drunk lit chicken. Make sure y'all comment and let me know how your lit chicken comes out. I got the little stand right off of Amazon. I didn't even have to leave my house to get it. Now, however, the beverage, you know, you gotta kind of be 21 to get it. So just let your mom and daddy make it if you ain't 21. Just just that. That's just a that's just on period. Um I, I don't know what else to tell you. Oh my gosh, how hungry <laughs> my shirt's went on. Yeah, well, well, I'm gonna go finish the rest of this, y'all. Um, it's a lot of chicken. The way the booty just stick out. Okay. Um. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna let that kind of trail before I put it up. Thank you so much for checking out this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know what you think about it, y'all. Please stay safe out there. I will definitely have more Courtney's Kitchen videos coming soon because it is so nice to be back in here whipping it up with y'all. I love you, and don't forget, you are everything, and Black Lives Matter. <laughs> Bye. See you in a second. Stop.